Hey, my HRIS peeps, and welcome to the very first episode of the HRIS Streamline Podcast. Now, this is a podcast where we will be unearthing HRIS or Human Resource Information Systems, excruciating pain points, exciting career opportunities, foreseen and unforeseen challenges, and much, much more. My name is Siobhan Mateen. I am the PJ or podcast jockey, also known as the host of the show. I also head the sourcing and recruiting efforts at Valued Personnel. Valued Personnel is a sourcing and recruitment solutions firm that solely focuses on connecting with people like you. Yes, you, the HRIS rock star that's out there implementing and streamlining human resource processes for employers across the country. Yeah, that was kind of a mouthful. Now, maybe you're looking for a new HRIS role. Maybe you're looking to find someone to help you evaluate and maintain your current HRIS processes. Or maybe you're looking to find someone to implement a new HRIS system. Either way, visit us at www.valuedpersonnel.com and connect with us today. Because we all know and understand all too well that without top HRIS talent, it will be extremely challenging to maintain the different databases, software, and computer systems that your company relies on to maintain your human resource processes. I know, I know, I had to do the shameless plug, but now that that's over, let's go ahead and jump right in. Now, in this first episode, I'd like to do three things. And I know you're probably asking, well, Siobhan, why three things? Or maybe you're not asking. And no, you won't hear any crickets chirping in the background either. (laughs) But either way, just know that my goal as the host of this show is to keep it to the point, yet interesting, and somewhat informally formal. Secondly, I'd like to tell you why this podcast even exists, in which I briefly shared a snippet earlier in the podcast. But yes, there's a reason for the season. Lastly, I'd like to take a moment to tell you a little bit about me and my own story, you know, who I am. So without further ado, here's what you can expect from the HRIS Streamline podcast in the episodes to come. All right, so first things first, I want to talk about why I decided to dedicate a podcast specifically to HRIS professionals. Do me a quick favor and take a look around. No, seriously, take a good look. And don't worry, I'll wait a few seconds. But tell me where in this industry will you find a podcast that empowers only my HRIS peeps? And yes, I said peeps. Remember I said before, ladies and gents, informally formal. Plus, I like peeps better anyway, especially better than colleagues. (laughs) But to continue on with that thought, Where else will you find a podcast that will only empower HRIS professionals, informing them of what's going on in the industry and where they can hear about some of the same challenges that they may be facing and how to overcome them? That's exactly why this podcast was born. Now, in order to accomplish this, the HRIS Streamline podcast shows will consist of candid interviews. Now, in these interviews, I will talk to professionals leading in this industry. I'll ask them very specific questions designed to help you, that's right, you, the rock star HRIS professional, stand out amongst the rest. Because in order to be a standout leader in this industry, you must first stay in the know. And in order to stay in the know, we must first start with what's buzzing. And no, no be buzzing sound effects here. Now, whether it's an industry pain, it may be a game, or even blockchain, Hey, that rhyme. I know, kind of corny. But anywho, but whatever the case may be, we're going to find out and we want you to know. Now, as far as the format of the podcast shows and what listeners can expect, we'll start off with asking the right questions to determine what the interviewee does specifically in this field. We want to know why they chose to work in this field, where they see this industry going in the next five years, and what are some key things HRIS professionals can do to ensure that their databases are up to date and integrated with the latest technology. Lastly, and most importantly, we want to know what career altering advice they would give someone planning a career in HRIS or looking to take their career to the next level. 
And because we ask our interviewees some of the same questions, you'll definitely begin to see similarities and differences almost immediately, potentially altering your life and preparing you for the next HRIS revolution. Now, a smidge or a tad bit about me, the host. Listen, I absolutely love connecting with people from all walks of life, and I have a passion for being a resource for others. I continue to hone that passion for being a resource for the people, working in various customer service related and management related roles before, during, and after I completed my bachelor's degree in human resource management. It's something that I actually enjoy doing day in and out. I mean, I could go on and on about why I decided to pursue co-founding value personnel, but I will say this, co-founding a business has taught me a lot about entrepreneurship. And it also taught me a lot about being resilient, no matter the size of the challenge that I was faced with. So enough about me. And let me tell you, I am super excited about this opportunity and embarking on this journey with you all. Are you ready? And if you're not, let me do my due diligence and get you pointed in the right direction as an HRIS professional. As there are some key things that are taking shape out here, as we all know, this is an ever-changing industry in this extremely globally competitive market. And in upcoming podcast episodes, I'm excited about the lineup of industry leaders we will be speaking with who may have the inside scoop or at least are able to provide an expert level perception. I look forward to the successes of each and every one of the HRIS professionals that I connect with. And I look forward to sharing that passion with you all in the episodes to come. For more information or if you wish to connect with me, you can email me at hrisstreamline at valuedpersonnel.com. Now, if you'd like to be a guest on the show, in which we'd love to have you, or maybe you would like to make a guest suggestion, let me know that as well. But before I go today, I'd like to leave you with one of my sayings called the bounce back forward. In the bounce back forward, it is that gentle reminder that always propels you forward past any obstacle nudging you through a new frontier. I am your host, Siobhan, and it has been an absolute pleasure to connect with you all. And and until next time, let's get the HRIS out of here. Talk to you later. Hey, my HRIS peeps.